All right, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. It's Tragic Life here. We just did everything we need to do. We got the rainbow, uh, let's see. We got the rainbow tail. Yeah, the only one you can get. Um, as you can see, I went back and got the green tail, so now we have two of those. Um, we are technic, or no, not technically. We are officially at the point of no return. Um, we've done got all the eidolons and saved all the people. Uh, Rydia has all the eidolons except for Odin. Uh, I think there's a couple more missing, but we're going to go ahead and work towards that. Uh, we're going to go ahead and move the story along. Um, it didn't take me long to get everything I needed, which is cool. Um, I don't have 99 spider soaks. Like I said, I got 93, so I'm hoping that's enough. If I fail because I missed six, I don't know what to do. So, we're going to continue forward. Don't forget to hit that like button and that subscribe button and leave me a comment. The glow. It's disappeared. Hope oh, this isn't a trap. It's a trap. Let's go. Hey, hey, hold it. He's ready to do it. All right. Mm. Oh. No. Odin. Okay, so what do we got to do here? Uh, have Rosa cast slow on them. Okay. Um, Edward used Bard Song. If he gets off haste march, awesome. If not, then have Kane, Cedar, and Rosa haste the party the old fashioned way. With everyone hasted, hit select and let the auto battle wall well on Odin. Turning it off to let Rosa heal if needed. Alright, let's go. Okay, so wait, 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 wait. Uh, so Rosa cast slow on them. Then we're going to use Bard Song. Hopefully we'll get the good one. Come on. Okay. Okay, so. Alright, stop. Uh, white magic, we're gonna go ahead and cast haste on everyone. Let's see, so we'll do it the old fashioned way. It's what it is. He doesn't have it. Okay, so you're gonna attack. Okay, that's cool, not the one we wanted, but okay. Um, let me some blank, so we're gonna do the blank. Okay, we're going to use Kira for you, you're going to attack. All right, we're going to do Blink again. And again. There we go. A little late, but okay. All right, we're gonna go ahead and blink again. And blink one more time. Now we're gonna go ahead and start attacking. All right. I do feel like hitting everyone with Kiraja. We don't have Kiraja, but we have Kiraga. We should be good. Now we just go ahead and attack until they need to heal. Ha! 
How long has it been, Cain? Your Highness. He's right. That's the voice of the late king. Rest his soul. And look at what lies before me. Rosa, Theodore, all my children are barren. How could I possibly turn my sword against any of you? Your Highness. You must save Caesar in your homeland. Okay. <clears throat> Why? Why, my lord? Cecil. Rydia. You. What? <laughs> my brother. Oh. For those that forgot or didn't know because they just kept tuning in now. Aha! So you're... Gobez. Now, we already knew that if we played the uh, Lunarian story. But anyway... You're still alive. Evidently, not that I have quite as many bodies as you do. It doesn't matter. You have all outlived your usefulness. You say this, but you've killed none of us. Okay. All right, we're going to pause because boss time. It is time. She has 45,600 life. We have Edge, Rydia, Gobez, Theodore, Rosa. Haste everyone with Theodore and Rosa. Rydia attacks with Mist Dragon while Rosa heals. You want to try our new band? Uh, you can combine Rosa's white magic with Rydia's black magic um, for Holy Verse. We're going to go ahead and do that because... Because, yeah. Um, we can also use Theodore and Rosa's Divine Heal, uh, which will help a lot. Uh, we'll nullify all her damage, especially if we fight during the waxing moon. I don't know what moon it is. I don't know how to check the moon in this point. Um, I wish I would have said something earlier, you know? Um, where she has to do, dish out is Mega Player. But it missed two members of his... So, alright. So, we're going to go ahead and try this. So, you're going to attack. You're going to do... Okay, you're going to attack. Okay. You're going to attack. Okay, that hurt. Alright, so we're going to go ahead... I haste you. Um... I think we're going to do it now. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and cure. Um. Oh my God, that's probably going to wipe. Okay, so which one is the Divine Heal? Theodore. He didn't say anything about Leviathan, but okay. Oh no, not the Eidolon Kings, too. Alright, yeah, so we need to start healing, so I'm gonna go ahead.
All right. If you see it jump like that, that means I accidentally hit the wrong button. It's gonna happen. Okay, so this is a dangerous thing. But we're doing pretty good otherwise. We all have pretty good lives, so I, I put myself in a good situation with this. This is gonna hurt though. That wasn't that bad. Bahamut? Yes. Alright, not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad. That's a lot of gil. Yeah. We got breakdown. Cool. We we've done it. No, we have not. Huh? Uh oh. Well done. Now I am off to collect the crystals. This planet serves no purpose any longer. Mm. Well, crud. Cecil, I think it's a long series of scenes. You were the real Cecil all along. I figured as much. Father. Do you know anything about those people? More than you do, probably. They said that the planet serves no purpose. Do they intend to destroy the world with that moon? They couldn't. Can't you stop it somehow? It is not the Lunarian's moon. I can't do anything. What? The crystals have all been taken up to that moon, right? Sid and I could fix up our airship to travel there. I hate to say this, given the situation and all, but we just can't do it, girl. The planet's gravitational pull is too much, even for my birds. There is a way. Oh? Would you like to save that? Yes. Um, we're going to save right here. Because, boy, oh boy. You've changed. Do I know you? You just, if you're just a straight beggar, then you should leave it merely assuming that you value your life. My apologies. Have I seen that man before? Oh. What is this, my lord? A token of our friendship and of my appreciation for your visit. Please accept it. What did I give to him? What have I done? Welcome back. 
I'm so glad to see you all, Theodore, Rosa, Sid, and most of all, Cain. Cecil. Father. Theodore, Rosa. Sid, Cain, what are you doing here? No. What am I doing here? Cecil. Father. Cecil. Okay, can we stop? Uh, no. So this is the limit of a half rate, as expected. How rude. What, what do you seek? Still, you are valuable samples, nonetheless. You will be useful. <sighs> Father. Father. I think there's some flashbacks right here. Hmm. Cecil. Cecil. Oh, sorry. He's finally regained his senses. Oh, thank goodness. Cecil. Father, Father, oh my God. Give it up. What's happened to my father? The man before you right now is nothing but an empty shell. What did that girl do to him? We will never get that answer. How do things go well? Excuse me. The moon's advance, severe winds, shows no sign of. It's all being caused by the moon. Collect yourself, my friend. Stay calm and get everyone to send play safe. We don't keep up, dun, 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 whatever. We've lost them. Sorry, but the whisper weed only has so much range to it, you know. What can be happening down on the surface right now? It's the moon's gravitational pull that's driving everything crazy. The moon's gravitational pull. Everybody knows how the moon affects the tides, but it works its will on other things too. I've heard theories that moon can affect the hearts and minds of animals and people, for that matter. And that goes double for this moon, no doubt. Just look at how enormous this thing is. With something that big so close to our planet, who could guess what will happen down there? It may be a matter of just being close to our planet before long. You think it'll keep on going? You mean to say it will collide with the Earth? Not just that. The moon would likely swallow our planet whole, given enough time. I mean, that's weird. No. We gotta get the crystals back and change the moon's path and quick. Ah! What is it now? The lunar whale, something's pulling on it. It's trying to gobble up our ship. What's going on? The moon has seized our ship. Wait, what? We're being pulled in. Luca, prepare for emergency landing. Roger. Dang it. <sighs> Cecil. Now what? Ah. Uh, father. Do you say anything other than father, dude? Cecil. Oh my god. Father, Cecil, it's getting worse the closer we are to the moon. Can we quit saying Father and Cecil? Cecil, what are you fighting against? Uh, 
Ugh. Oh, it's magic. I'm oh, sorry. Commercial in the background. Sorry, guys. Oof. How is everyone? Father. All right. So we're we're good now. Um. So at this point, we have to decide who our top five people are because we're gonna create a party of everybody. Um. So I'm not really sure what to do here. Hold on. Look at the people we've gathered in this room. We haven't got a thing to worry about. Isn't that right, Cecil? Okay. I'm going to talk to them all. <sighs> no. Maybe. I don't know. I have come back for one single reason, to stop the moon that threatens us all. Hey, buddy. Cecil's going to come back for us. We'll put an end to this moon together. Hey, buddy. You missed Dad? Ow! Well, come on up here! Come on, Cecil, wake up. We're all waiting on you. Cecil's still with us. The light hasn't left his eyes. I don't know what she said, so we're going to talk to her again. We can't very well give up on him yet, can we? All right. Charlie, I love you. I know Cecil is praying for us. Praying for the moon to disappear, for our homeland to be saved. Charlie, I can't see. I love you, buddy, but I can't see. Charlie. Charlie. Ah. Oh, right here. That's better. I gotta be able to see the TV, buddy. Screen, whatever, not TV, but. I believe in Cecil. I'm sure he will lead us to victory. Cecil will be back for us, and then we will be able to go back to our homeland. Come on, people, don't let me catch you with those hag hang dogs looks on your face. We need to stay on the move. Cecil wouldn't want it any other way, now would he? So I'm going to follow the guide, exactly. So believe me, I'm staying in for this ride. We've got to help Cecil out. <laughs> Cecil, Elder, and everyone back on the blue planet, please lend us your power. All right, so let's see. What's downstairs? Is there more? There is. I can't wait to see how well our ninja jutsu serves us here. Never in my dreams did I imagine I would visit the moon one day. I suppose I should rebel, revel in the fact I lived long enough to see this moment. I I will face this challenge. Paroma is doing everything she can for all of us here. I cannot let her down. Besides, Edge had given me the greatest evil on ninjutsu training anyone could possibly hope to receive. If my master wills it, I will go anywhere I am needed. If my martial arts skills can serve to help, then I'll fight twice as hard until Cecil comes back. I wonder if this is the same moon as the one that left us back then. I, um, is it really alright? I mean, if I went with you? Okay, so we have to pick, I'll do that, why not, five people. So we're going to go and talk about the ones we're going to eliminate. I already know who I'm going to pick. Uh, the eight evil on four, Harley, Kalka, Rina, they're all out. They, they're not that good. Uh, Cecil and Lenora are out. They're strong normally, but Lenora isn't too tough until she gets to level 80 or so, while Cecil is currently crippled with low stats. No experience gain and no bans for purpose plot. Uh, we need a white mage. So we have two, Porum and Rosa. Porum's spirit, white mage magic, and MP are higher than Rosa's, but Rosa has superior offense with bows and aim. We also need a black mage. Rydia has lower intelligence than Pallone, but has summons which can pierce reflect and can use silk to help. Govez has weaker intelligence and MP than both of them, but has the advantage of superior HP and defense, as well as he's a better attacker. And then we have three attackers. Kane, Edge, and Theodore are all around awesome. Luca, Sid, Yang have high HP and strength, low MP and speed. Ursula isn't as effective as Yang offensively, but has a much higher speed. Edward is okay. Bard Song and Salve have their uses, but I would not use him. 
Um, you can switch anytime you want to. I, it's it not advised because the deeper you go, the longer you're in there, the harder the bad guys are. So you'll be switching to weaker characters. Um, Okay, so, uh, so before we do anything, we need to go ahead and, this is going to take a second, let me go ahead and do this, what I'm going to do off screen is I'm going to talk to everyone that's not going to be part of my party, and I'm going to take off their armor or weapons so that I can make sure that everyone has uh, what they're supposed to have, okay? Um, so I'll be right back. Alright, welcome back, so we're going to go pick our party now. So first person we're picking, Theodore. All right, then we're going to do Palom. And you can do whatever you want. This is the one I'm going to be doing. Uh, I'm following this guide. This guide has been pretty solid, so I'm not going to break away from it at this point since it's been... All right, we're going to use Perome and Ursula. So that's going to be our party of five. Now, equipment-wise, uh, let's see what we got. We're going to give him the Defender and a Diamond Shield. Okay, we're going to give him the officer's hat. Now, I may not have all the, the... The only thing I may be struggling here with is I may not have all the Giants clubs. Um, and that's okay. Alright, so... Alright, so now... Theodore is set. Now we're going to go to work with... We're going to go ahead and give... The Fairy Rod... Make sure Palom, yeah, okay. Um, do we have a circlet? We do. We're gonna give you a luminous robe. I'm missing a rare band. Oh, no, it's right there. Okay, good. All right, so Ogre Killer. We're going to give you the Aegis Shield. Um, Diamond Helm. Diamond Armor. Giant's Club, cool. Um, we're going to give her the Rune Staff. I don't see it. I hope I didn't sell it. I'll regret that if I did. Right, we're going to give her the rapid wing ring. So we're missing um, the rune staff. Okay, so let's see. Let's make sure I give her the strongest staff. Okay, it is what it is. All right, metal knuckles, metal knuckles, ribbon, black belt G. Do we have any more Giants gloves? We don't. So let's see what we can give her. Diamond armlet's a good option. I feel like we're trying to build her strength, so... Okay, so we're going to go ahead and give her... The Hyper Wrist for the moment. Okay, so there's a lot of uh, bands we can get, but we're not going to go ahead and do that. Uh, we're going to rest up. So I'm not really sure where we go to start this, but let's go ahead and party. Okay. Hmm. 
Okay, you don't have anything I want. I was hoping you'd have. You can buy X potions, that's cool. Wow, you can buy a lot of cool stuff. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and buy a couple of high potions. Go to Phoenix Downs. We're gonna We're pretty good on everything. I was hoping for more, but it is what it is. You really don't have anything. Dang. Okay. Alright. <clears throat> Okay, I'm not really sure what we're doing here, so um, I'm probably going to go in here and... Oh, these guys are new. They're called Material. And you see they're very strong. Holy... Not X Potion. So this should be Subterranean. Alright, so the one thing that I need to mention before we move forward is you can't use Cottages on it because that's not an overworld. So fun stuff. So until next time, adios amigos.